welcome back. Can everybody hear me? Welcome. Is anyone alive? <laughs> Can anyone hear me? That we introduce our host for tonight, Melissa Armo, stockswish.com. Thank you, Kathy. <laughs> Thank you very much for that introduction. So welcome everyone, my name is Melissa Armo. If you have questions as we go along today, you can type it in the room. And I own my own company called The Stock Swoosh. So today I'm going to give a short lecture here and you can write any questions as we go along. I see some familiar faces. Uh, but again, if you have questions, I'll answer them as we go. Today we're going to talk about how you can earn 25 grand a month trading gaps. So I've been doing gaps for 10 years, okay? 2008 I started. And if you've never traded gaps, it's a very unique way to look at the market. I also talk on Fox News and Fox Business Network about stocks. So if you're interested, you can find me on Fox. I will be on tomorrow evening at six o'clock. And if you'd like more information, you can contact me uh, at, by phone or email, melissa at the stock or 929 gap I love GAP. So we're gonna talk really about uh, trading and, and specifically trading for a career because if you're if your goal is to make twenty thousand dollars plus a month twenty grand twenty five pray it was five it's about five six grand a week okay if you're looking to do that then you could do this for a living and a lot of people get into trading and they dabble with it and they do it part time here and there but I'm telling you this is serious money and if you want to make that kind of money then you have to take it seriously as if it is going to be your career now maybe you have to transition, but uh, uh, the middle of the year, we're in July, in fact it's almost August, but it's a good time to evaluate, are you making the money that you want to for this year? Are you on track for your goals? Financially for your job or, or, or whatever you're doing right now, if you're working for somebody else, or even if you are trading. So if you're trading right now, are you on track? And if you're not, how are you gonna get on track, okay? When I started out trading, again, this was 10 years ago, <clears throat> the reason I did it is because I wanted to change careers. I worked doing mortgages and I worked seven days a week. I couldn't stand it by the time I got out. I mean, I just couldn't. It was like I had no break and I didn't like it. And I'm telling you, when you do something that you enjoy, it makes a huge difference in the quality of your life. When you hate your job, you, you, you're miserable. And when you love your job, every day can be very, very happy, okay? So it's a huge, massive difference between doing something that you enjoy and doing something that you don't like at all. So if you've ever thought about trading, one of the benefits is that you work for yourself. You work for yourself, you work from home. You also can make a lot of money trading the market. All right, so that's another very positive aspect of it too. The amount that you make is only dependent on your risk. And as I was saying earlier, I mean, I do enjoy trading. So I enjoy reading charts. I love reading charts. I love being able to predict where stock is going to go. That's something I do extremely well. And we're gonna talk about a couple of those calls here tonight. Facebook fell off a planet today. And I predicted that last week on the earnings from Thursday to today. That to me is fun. And also I trade a short time of the day, which makes it very fun too. So you can do other things with your life. I happen to be doing TV, which I love, okay, but you could do other things too. You could spend time with your family, you can go golfing, whatever you want to do, all right? It's the summer here in New York, weather's beautiful, lots of things to do, Central Park is out there. I mean, you have the rest of the day to yourself once you're out of the trades. So if you, if you want to do this, it can offer you a you know a, a lifelong career and not only that you can look at it as something that you can do for long-term investments where you don't have to rely on a stockbroker necessarily to take your trades or manage your retirement accounts okay so why trade gaps trading is a career and it's a career that can offer you financial freedom fulfillment and happiness if you think you're interested okay that's why you're here you're here to find out if you're interested and, or maybe you are interested, you know you are, but you don't have a strategy to trade. That might be the other reason you're here, all right? 
You can have the life you want if you're willing to learn something new and then develop the skills to become successful in a new industry, which would be trading, which would be the market, which would be stocks, okay? So I do stocks. So you can develop skills in anything new and it doesn't have to take forever. I know a lot of people say, uh, you know, if you learn a good system, a good strategy, you can do it right out of the gate. In fact, there was a, someone, a man that signed up for the class yesterday. He's doing the class this weekend. He made money today in the trades already. And he almost didn't even sign up. If he, if he would have waited one more day, he would have missed today's trades, huge calls today. So, you know, you can do this, but you gotta follow what I say, all right? And gaps do set up daily. Now, right now we're in earnings season. What does that mean? Companies report their, their earnings four times a year. It's quarterly earnings season. So all of the month of July and, and, and August, up until Labor Day is a very busy time to trade. It's a very profitable time to trade and to be in my trading room with me. So that's why I'm doing classes um, at this time. Twitter hard earnings, okay, was last week on Friday. Great call. We're gonna go over this trade today. Fell, it was a short, okay? Now what is a gap? For those of you that don't know, it's the difference between the close and the open. This is a daily chart of Twitter. And gaps happen every day in the market, or most days, okay? Fell, continued down today and they happen quick. When you look at those bars, you maybe can't tell from the daily chart, but I can tell when I'm watching them, and I'm watching them in the one minute, they set up very, very fast. And that is attractive. It's attractive to me as a trader to set up and trade and get in and out very, very quickly. So you're, you're working for full-time pay with part-time hours because you're only in and out of the trades fast. That is something that I like a lot. I don't have to sit and wait for trades to set up till 11 o'clock, noon. I don't have to wait for them to go till 12 o'clock either. Most day traders are not taking their any entries in any trades until 10 o'clock or later, okay? We are in and out between 9.30 and 10 o'clock Eastern time. And I'm seeing some people sign in. You can always email me uh, or write a question in the room if you have questions as we go along here, FYI, for the people that are signing in late. Anyways, you don't work all day. So we're in and out in the morning. You're not training till four. And you can also do this from home, which is attractive too, because you don't have to commute. You don't have to work on Wall Street. You don't even have to live in New York to trade the market. And they set up fast, which is what I like, and we're gonna talk about some of these trades. So if you learn how to trade, you can be your own boss, which is a positive thing, and you can work your own schedule, and you could do it in between another job if you have, or, or even if you're doing something else like real estate. There is a trading strategy that I trade, and this is what I do, and I also teach it. It sets up very quickly each morning, and the strategy is gaps. I name my system Golden Gaps, but gaps are out there, and a lot of people do gaps, but they don't do them correctly. So gaps not only work fast if you get them right, okay, but they also offer a good risk-to-reward payout. This is important because you need a sustainable trading method if you want to tr trading to be your career. If this is something that you really, really want to do, then you have to have something that's gonna make a good risk to reward potential, set up on a regular basis, and have big moves. So if you wanna do this and trade for a living, what do you need? A strategy, that's number one. You also need a strategy that's reliable, sets up, on, sets up often on a regular basis, and it's gotta have a good risk to reward payout. Because you have to be able to pay yourself. In other words, what do I mean? I mean, if you risk a dollar, you're looking to make a dollar. You're not risking 10 cents to make one penny. You're not risking a dollar to make 10 cents, okay? You have to have a one around flip around or at least a half. It's not a good trade to risk a buck and make 10 cents. And a lot of people trade like that. A lot of people scalp, I call it scalp. We don't scalp. We're looking for a move. We're looking for a money move. And I'm gonna show you that in, in the Twitter. Any questions so far here? I see some people signing in late. Anyways, I really think, honestly, that in this environment, in 2018, and particularly, um, you know, the political environment right now, everything, it's, it's very interesting, the way the economy is setting up, the way people are, more people are going out there, and they're working for themselves. They're taking it upon themselves to say, you know what, they may have jobs, but they're saying, I deserve more. I deserve a better job. I deserve a better salary. And if they're not getting it from their employers, they're quitting. 
People are quitting, they're finding other jobs. People are realizing they can work for themselves. And day trading is something where you can work for yourself and you have to be your own boss. And that means you have to take it as seriously as if you opened up a business and you hired your own employees, all right? You have to set yourself up for success. When I start out in the morning, I have everything figured out before, before even the market opens, before 9.30, what I wanna do, what stock I like, whether I wanna do anything, okay? One strategy is all you need to be successful. Being a jack of all trades really doesn't make you any money. I've talked to so many people in the six years that had the business, the stock swoosh, and they say, well, I've been trading for 20 plus years. I mean, you know, it doesn't matter if you know all kinds of information, if it doesn't make you a dollar, if it doesn't make you any money, if you're not profitable, it doesn't mean crap, okay? You have to have a system and a strategy that actually works and makes you money because that's why you're gonna do it, all right? Even though trading's fun, you have to see the results. And I'm telling you that getting good at one thing and becoming an expert at one thing counts. So the market can offer you a real lifelong career if you have a strategy that makes money consistently. So what is the thing that I do? What would you come if you wanted to learn from me? If you wanted to take this seriously and really learn it and do it and trade in the room with me, it's called gaps. And I call my system golden gaps because it's like finding gold in the market. Facebook and Twitter are great examples. Although I could give you a million, um, but you know, we're gonna talk about these here today. So what is a golden gap? A golden gap is a gap that moves in the direction of the gap. So if the stock gap's down, you're looking to short it. If the stock gap's up, you'd be looking to go long it. Who makes golden gaps? Institutional money makes and creates these gaps and they follow them through, okay? They follow them through in the gap themselves. So in the case of a bullish gap, institutions are buying the stock. Therefore, the stock moves higher on the trading day. In the case of a bearish gap, institutions are selling or shorting the stock. Therefore, the stock moves lower on the trading day, okay? So how do you make money? You only can make money shorting a stock if the price is dropping. For example, if you short it at 10 bucks, if it goes under $10, you're gonna be up. If it goes over 10, you're down. So you don't want that to happen. You wanna get in a stock that's dropping if you're shorting. And I like to focus on shorts, okay? So when you're trading, you have to take risk, whatever that risk amount is, whether it's $500, $200, $1,000, whatever you're risking. Remember you're learning to flip it around at least once, that's your goal. But either way, okay, you have to have high odds. You can't just say, well, I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna take this. You can't take 10 trades and have five work and five fail. No, you wanna have high odds. High odds means the more that if you take 10 trades, more are gonna work than fail. All right, so anything that can put the odds in your favor to trade will give you an edge. The Golden Gap system gives you an edge because it uses a rating or a scoring system that pick the stock to trade. I mean, that's how I do it. That's how I pick the stocks each day that we do. And it reads the price of the gap and I'm doing it in the pre-market using technical analysis on an advanced level. And it pinpoints which stock to trade that day and in what direction. So the high probability is in the quality and the detail in the rating system very important and so 26 points is what i look at it seems like a lot of stuff and seems like a lot of information but it's really in the detail and it only takes a few minutes to rate one gap so you get good at it you get used to it it takes just a couple of minutes and you're in and you're and you're out of it in a couple of minutes so the prep time i say give yourself one hour before the before the open to prep yourself and then just a few minutes between 9 30 and 10 to take a trade okay any questions so far about anything from anyone that's here? I wanna give some time for questions if I'm going along. Okay. Anyways, getting back to what I was saying. So the Golden Gap system, that's what I do. I created my own system myself. And I did it because I wanted to find a way to make money in the market every day. And I prefer to short. So the Golden Gap system is a 26 point professional bearish gap rating system. The purpose of the system is to help you evaluate which gap to trade each morning using a checklist. So the checklist goes through, boom, boom, boom. And it's you're using a 26 point checklist to trade and that creates the high probability of success. Okay, that when I go through and I rate the gap, that puts the odds in my favor if it gets a lot of points. So I'm looking for 20 points or more. Okay, and I'm not looking for a perfect score, I'm looking for a high score, high probability, okay? So I go through and I'm trying to find what I'm doing before 
the open. Now, a lot of people say to me, well, how do you find gaps? What do you do? How do you find them? Okay. Well, I go through, you can look up all the earnings that are out, typically stocks gap that have earnings, or look on your scanner. A lot of places have scanners that are included with your platform for free. Or you can pay for a scanner if you want to. It's totally, totally up to you. But a lot of these things is free information where you find the stocks that are gapping. And then you take them and you go through the checklist and you qualify them. Okay? And that's what you would learn how to do from me. So how can you make a career out of trading golden gaps? You trade and you're looking for what? You're looking for one gap each day. So if there's Monday through Friday, okay, you're trying to find five gaps a week. You might find more than one again, more than one a day, okay? I prefer to do one per day, say you get two. If everything rates good, you could do more than one a day. Sometimes you only find three a week in non-earning season. But either way, you're hitting it with the quality, keeping the losses down, keeping the win ratio up, okay? You're looking for a quality gap. A quality gap is one that rates high enough to trade based on the 26 point rating system, okay? So for every dollar, you're looking for a buck, that's your goal. Every once in a while, you will find a trade that will go way more past what you risked, which is amazing. And it happens and it happens a lot and it typically happens in earnings season. But again, it's, it's very interesting to me. Uh, some people trade and they, are, and they make such little amounts of money for such big amount of risk. Now there are trades where I am taking advanced risk, that's true, but I'm looking for huge moves then. So you have to be realistic, but you also have to have a good sense of what makes sense. It does not make sense to risk $1,000 to make 100 bucks. It doesn't make sense to risk $1,000 to make 250 bucks. It does make sense to risk $1,000 and make 1000 bucks. okay? That makes sense. Does everyone understand? Any questions? Okay. So, getting back to what I was saying, if you want to trade and if you want to be serious about it, you got to have the knowledge. The knowledge is so key. And if you have the right knowledge, guess what? You've got the power and the money will come. And then the, then the market isn't controlling you. And you know, you're not controlling the market. You can't force these stocks to move. However, that's why you take the trade and you use stops, okay? And we're gonna go over that too. Now, let's go over Twitter. So Twitter was an earnings play that happened last week on Friday, stock closed here. This is in the evening, it closed on Thursday night, boom. Gap down in the morning, fell. So this was Friday, this is Monday. So I called an option trade in Twitter. You could have bought a put, or you could have done the day trade. Here was the day trade on Friday. So what happened here? The stock closed around 43 and opened around 37 something. And where did it fall on the day? Down to 34. So the stock had a $3 plus move on the day on Friday. And today it had almost a $3 plus move. So this is momentum. This is what I'm talking about. This is institutional selling. I predicted that Twitter would drop before this bar occurred and this one too. That's how I call it the trades, okay? which I call it a put and an equity trade, short, all right? Any questions? So this is what you would look for every day. With me in the room, you would learn the system in the class, and then you could trade on your own or you could join the room, that's up to you. Now, let's go over Twitter. So Twitter closed here, gap down. This was Friday. This is Friday's trade, play of the day. Dropped, pushed back, held. Boom, shorted it, got the drop. So you could have taken Twitter here and got it out. Or you could have taken Twitter here and held it all day. I prefer to trade in the morning between 9.30 and 10 a.m. Eastern time, which you can see the move it made. Went to the target, went to the dream target on the day. But honestly, again, I like to be in and out quick. Boom, 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 boom. Whichever you wanna do. But this is what you would learn from me. Any questions? Let's look at the trade. Not gonna be any questions here, but I'm just gonna keep going. If you totally don't understand anything I'm saying, then then I mean you gotta you gotta write something. The price of the short in Twitter, 3702, 6,000 shares is an advanced size. 
And he said 36.10, nowhere near the low. Nowhere near the low at all. I'm going to go back and show you that in a minute, but this is a quick trade. You're in and out in five minutes, less than five minutes. You could have made 5,580 bucks. And that is more money than some people make in an entire week, let alone one trade, let alone in five minutes. Okay. Does everyone understand? So once you get good, once you know what to do, you can take this kind of risk. Now this is on target to wake, make way more than 25 grand a month. I'm using that uh, for the webinar title, but you would, you could take, could have taken way less size in this trade here because there was only one trade on one of the days of the week last week. But the point is though that all you need is one good trade a day and keep your losses down, put the stops in, get out when you're up and you're good. So I look to short. I look to short and I'm looking to short stocks that are familiar that you would know that you would think about that you would know and we're rating the gap to know that Twitter is a short and not a long. Okay, so I predict. I predict that Twitter is going to drop before it opens, which is what I did on the 27th, the morning of. Any questions about, about Twitter, about day trading, about this? Okay, quiet group tonight. Anyways, I wanted to put the stats here for July. Started out, took, a, took some time off the beginning of July. Earnings season started mid second week of July. So August, all the month of August is busy with earnings season, but I just want you to see here how you can make this kind of money. Now we got one more day left in July, we'll see what we get. If you're interested in a trial to the live trading room, you can email me at melissa at thestockswish.com to be in the trading room the rest of this week. But these are all the trades from July. So you see here on average, some days, you will do one trade. Most of the days eBay was a good one. We have a big one. Some days are big, some days are small, some days are medium. Netflix was a losing day. That's rare, but every once in a while you might have a day where you are losing, but that's why you stop. You don't go crazy. You see how you can have these huge trades when they just fall out of the sky, like eBay, General Motors, Twitter. Don't go crazy and trade all day. Stick within the time frame. stick within the parameters, okay? that I'm giving you, that I'm giving you in the system. Okay, no day trades today in the room on the 30th. Now, I wanna go over Facebook. Facebook was an option that I called last week on Thursday, no, it was Wednesday? No, it was Thursday, Facebook was Thursday too. Facebook was here, okay? Open, rally, open, dropped, fell. Facebook was a huge option trade that I called on Thursday, fell and broke today, fell off the planet. So I predicted Facebook would fall, we shorted it here, and then it was a put, called the put here, could have got out today. Now this could still be lower, but this was a huge move today. So you can trade gaps using options as well. Same philosophy, same system. You're taking, I'm rating the gap. If you sign up for the option letter, then I send you the trade. If you're day trading it actively, you gotta be in the room. But I called two puts here, 175 went well through the strike, 170 went well through the strike. This is out through the end of this week. It was a huge, huge move, almost went to the dream target. All right, so, you know, again, it's earnings season. It's a good time to trade, it's a good time to make money, but Facebook was an amazing call to see that it would break as a short because a lot of people went long it. How do I know? Just going back here quickly, the stock was green, green and huge, you see the volume. This stock was all the way up at 180, over 180 on the day of the gap down. And we shorted it. And you can see where it's at today, okay? How did I know that would happen? How could I predict it? Because I'm very good at my system, okay? I'm good at predicting what's gonna get sell off. I'm good at predicting what's gonna get bought. All right? Anyways, if you bought an option trade and paid a buck, your cost would have been what? 10 contracts, $1,000. You could have sold today and made four fifteen. dollars You could have made $3,150 on one trade in Facebook, buying the puts, okay? And you would have made a 315% return on investment. So this is the same exact trade, but with an advanced risk, you would have risked four grand, which sounds like a lot, but your profit would have been what? $12,600 in one trade. You took the trade on Facebook on Thursday and got out of it today. So you had to wait three days for this. So this is an option trade, which sometimes you day trade and sometimes you do overnight. Huge, huge move. 315% return investments. Remember I 
told you you're looking to get one to one, every once in a while you're gonna go one that's way more than that. That's three to one or more like this. And I do think Facebook could be lower, but with an expiration date of Friday, I think the best thing to do was to get out. So, so many people bought this stock on Thursday and we shorted it, okay? So many people can't make $12,600 in a month, let alone in one trade. And it just goes to show you, when you get really good at something, you can really make bank. It's just that a lot of people just don't, they never focus, they never get good, they never, they lose conviction, they lose confidence, they can't risk the, they can't risk four grand because they simply don't have any confidence at all and why it would work. I know why I'm saying this is going to work because of this, because of the points, because I'm rating it, because it rates high, because I'm seeing what the price is gonna do. I'm predicting it's going to sell off and I was right. And I'm right way more than I'm not, okay, which is why I'm on TV, I have a successful business, I'm doing this for 10 years, but I'm telling you that without that confidence level, you'll never get to the point where you'll make any money at all, let alone 25 grand a month. How do you get the confidence? The knowledge, the knowledge. Following me is great. Following me is great if you did the class and joined the room, it's great, it helps your confidence, that's true. Being green helps your confidence. You have to do the class to join the room. But learning it is so much better because then you know it too. And then I call it the trades, and you do it with me and you get it and it all sinks together and it all gels and then everything just gels together in one thing okay when you trade you have to have a plan of action to win you've got to have a plan of action that strategically you say i'm going to do this it's going to make sense you go for it you take the risk you do it all right so my whole philosophy is I'm looking at a large time frame, but then I'm taking the trades in a smaller time frame. I'm looking at the daily chart to make the rating, then I'm taking it on the one minute for a high level of degree of focus and accuracy because we're putting in the entry, we're putting in the stop, we're trading on the one. I'm taking the risk on that because I know I'm gonna get out in a few minutes or sometimes a few seconds. But I'm looking at the daily chart to get the directional bias to say, Facebook is gonna sell off, Twitter is gonna sell off, but then I take the trade on the one, okay? For the day trades, options are different. It doesn't matter, you can take an option quick or you can do it out for longer if you want, okay? But the only difference between a beginner trader, an intermediate trader, and advanced trader is size. That's the only thing. Why do some people make 100 bucks and some people make almost six grand? You have to determine what you can afford but any money is good money. If you made $100 a day, that's $500 by Monday through Friday, that's good. It's better than losing. So start with a small account if that's all you can afford and build it up, okay? You can open up a prop account with approximately $2,500 at most good prop broker places. You start there, you build it up, build it up, build it from 2,500 to five, build it from five to 10 to get to the point where you can risk more. It's the best thing to do, okay? Any questions? Now, getting back to what I was saying, it's the size. So 200 shares, something drops a buck, sure, you make $200. 2,000, something drops a dollar, you make two grand. 8,000 drops a dollar, you make eight grand, okay? So it's not impossible. It's just that you have to get to the point where you can take the size. It's not just the size of your account, although that's part of it. It's the knowledge, it's the information, it's the, it's the conviction. I talk about it, it's the conviction. So I teach a class. My method is a 26 point rating system. It teaches people how to trade the stock of the day. It teaches advanced technical analysis in a daily chart. You rate the gap, you say, yes, I like it, it's good. We wait for the setup, we take it in the morning. Gaps are great because you can do them for swing trades, you can do it for options, you can do it for long-term investing, or you can do them for day trades. And when you can do this for something for long-term investing, I mean, you can invest your own money. You don't have to go to a stock broker. Most of the trades have amazing follow through. Look at this market. This is a chart of the SPY. Okay, this is the ETF for the S&P. We had an enormous power trend rally all in 2017. How did you get in the right stocks? Were you in the right things invested in your 401k? If not, you weren't looking at the right things. Okay, so this is a great example, <coughs> excuse me, of why it's so important to know how to make accurate decisions specifically so that you can look out for yourself even in the long term. Any questions? Okay. Anyways, as I was saying, you know, uh, most of the people that I teach is a 50-50. Some have traded before, some have never traded at all. 
Um, and, you know, a lot of them are just regular people. It's not like I'm teaching all these millionaires or something. I mean, people are just regular people. Some have small accounts, some have medium accounts, some have big accounts, and they're learning as they go. They're in the room, they're following me. Uh, you know, I gotta be honest with you, you know, <laughs> excuse me, a lot of people made money in the Twitter, and then some people made money in Facebook, some people took the trade and killed it. So it, it, it just takes time to believe in the things that I'm saying. But if you listen to me, I'm telling you, I don't steer you the wrong way. I really am extremely good at what I do. And it's something that if you've been following me, you probably know this. And if you haven't taken the class, I guess you gotta ask yourself why. I would not wait. You're missing out on a huge opportunities to make money. And a lot of people are trading and losing. And I don't feel sorry for those people because they just don't understand what to do and they're not trying to do anything to better the situation. If you want to better your situation, financially, career-wise, trading-wise, your job, if you've never traded, it is up to you. No one's going to come knock on your door and offer you everything in the world and every opportunity in the world for free the second. You have to make it happen for yourself. You and only you. Okay? Trading can offer you a career. Trading can offer you money. It's going to cost you. You have to pay to do my class and you have to open up a trading account. But it's certainly something that's doable and it's certainly something that you can do. You, it's, it's called motivation. It's called motivation and I know. It took me motivation 10 years ago. It's taken me motivation to do television. That took several years to get to this point I'm at now too. But I'm a very motivated person. I'm ambitious, okay? You don't have to be as ambitious as me, but I'm telling you, if you wanna make a lot of money in the market, then you kinda do, okay? You wanna hit these numbers, you wanna make five grand in one trade, you gotta have a little bit of ambition in you. And if you do, you can do it, okay? So trading is something where it offers you the personal freedom for unlimited potential for growth and success. And again, the nice thing is you can do options, you can do the day trades, you can do both. So my class is called the Golden Gap Course. It will help you find success in the market. And I, I do a little motivation in between in some of my classes. I teach the Wealth Manifestation class, which is a very interesting class too. And I say to people, you know, what do you need to succeed? And I call it the four C's. Number one, you need clarity. You have to have a daily focus and you also need to know what your goal is. If your goal is to make $500 a day, that's it, okay? When you're up, you're up, you stop. You don't keep trading and give it back. What else do you need? Confidence. It doesn't matter if every person you've ever known has failed at this. It doesn't matter if you know your best friend hates you for doing this or whatever. It doesn't matter if you're the only one that believes in yourself. Confidence is important. I don't care what the odds are. I don't care if the odds are against you. If you believe in yourself and you have confidence and it's high, you can do it. You also need conviction in, in what makes sense, what you're doing. And what I do has a lot of common sense because I'm going with the institutions. That makes sense. Going with regular traders does not make sense. Those lose, they don't have any money. Institutions, the big banks, hedge funds, they have money. They move the market when they buy and sell stocks. So you get the conviction from that. Understanding the philosophy from it, okay? And also it takes commitment. It means learning. It means going over your trades. It means admitting when you made a mistake. It also means going after it hard and taking the risk and not being afraid and believing, believing that it's gonna work and that all the energy and time and effort and financial amount of money that you put into it is going to pay off. And when you get to the point where you believe and have the commitment, there's no looking back. I had a friend, and I, I've told this story before, I know. I had a friend that said to me, and this was like 2008, maybe it was the beginning of 2009, and I was losing, I didn't know what I was doing. I was still calculating and figuring out all the points. And he said, Melissa, you're losing, how much money are you gonna lose? Because I figured out my system, and the, what, the reason my system is so good is because I did it with real cash. I did not trade on a demo. I did not figure out the 26 points with fake money. I did it with real money, and that is the reason it's so good and works. Because when you really do something with real cash, you see, you feel it, you know it, and you believe in it. And he said, well, how, when are you gonna stop? I said, I'm never gonna stop. I'm never gonna stop till I figure it out. And then I did, okay? So it's the commitment. It's not looking back. It's not ever, ever making excuses or saying you're gonna quit. You go through and you full on put the throttle in and you put the gas in the pedal and you go, okay? You're forging ahead, all right? It is the middle of the year. I mean, I went to the store the other day, I said this to you in some video last week, they're selling pumpkin stuff. Pumpkin stuff, and I mean, it's 85 degrees in New York. 
and they are selling Halloween things already. I mean, it's crazy. Before you know it, it is going to be the holidays. I'm telling you, before you know it, it's going to be the holidays, Thanksgiving, Halloween, Christmas, and you're going to say, oh my God, where did 2018 go? It went by like nothing. And now you're going to say, I didn't do anything I wanted to do this year. I didn't make the money I wanted to make. I didn't achieve my goals. I, did, I, don't, I don't know why I just wasted this whole year. I'm telling you, don't let the whole year go by. More than half the year is gone. If you are not on pace for your goals financially or with your trading, get on board. Do not wait till it's too late. Stop making excuses for moving forward. It's hard to believe. I. It's one year I've been on Fox. I can't even believe it. A year already. It feels like it went by like that. Okay? Time keeps going so quick, so fast, and there's nothing you can do to stop it. Nothing. Before you know it, it's 6 o'clock tonight. Before you know it, I'll be getting ready for bed, getting up tomorrow morning. It'll be 6 a.m. I'll be at spin class, and then I'll be up, up at the market already. I mean, just you can't stop the time that goes on. So take advantage of opportunities when they're being given to you. And I've said this before. Every person that finds me right now, because I'm still relatively small, you know, compared to other places out there and compared to other people even on TV, everyone that finds me now is lucky to find me and meant to be because I still have the time to talk to people, to email them back individually, to give them the personal service and attention that they need. And there will come a day when I won't have the time to do that because I'm going to be too big. Don't miss this opportunity to come and learn from me individually, all right? You will not regret it. So the Golden Gap course is a complete system to use to trade. It gives you all the pieces of the puzzle to trade. Whether you want to do options, whether you want to do day trades, it's up to you. So the class is a two-day course on how to strategically find, pick, and place stocks that are professional bearish gaps. The class is online. You could be anywhere in the world and take it. The class for August, which I'm doing this coming weekend so that people can get in for this whole month to make money in August for the earnings season is August 4th and 5th. It's 9 to 5. Cost of the class is $54.99. You'll learn everything I know in the nuts and bolts in the two days. It's full on, okay? And then you could be in the room then for the earnings season, which is going to be the whole month of August, and it's a big, big time. This was one of the students from the class in July, and I must tell you that I've heard this before, but this is one of the reasons I'm very excited to do TV. He said that I teach in an understandable way, and that he said it was a great teacher, and I do think that I, I teach things that are advanced in a way that breaks them down that anyone can get them. Someone that's traded for a while or someone that's brand, brand new. I have a, a way to, to be relatable. I have a way to be relatable to people to teach advanced concepts in a way that even that anyone can understand them. And I think that's a gift. It's a gift that I have. And it's one of the reasons that I'm a good teacher. Um, and it's one of the reasons that I've been talking on TV. And I, I hopefully will be, get a chance to talk more on TV in longer spots, more advanced things about teaching things. Uh, you know, a lot of people are interested to learn about the market and they don't understand it. They find it overwhelming. They find it uh, scary. Trading is not scary. It's just that a lot of people talk about things in a way that sounds like it's over their head, but it's really not. It's just that you need to understand the concepts with really is a lot of it. It has to do with the person that's teaching the concepts, not the concepts themselves. Okay. Hopefully that makes sense. Um, anyways, if you're interested, you can take the class this weekend. It's about empowering yourself to trade. I'm giving you the knowledge, but it is you. You and you alone that are taking the trades, all right? If you'd like a trial this week, you're more than willing to have one. You can email me. I'll send you a trial. You can be in the room. Apple's out tomorrow night. Should be a good one. <coughs> I have no idea what we get tomorrow morning, though, before then. Um, but it has been a solid year of 2018. And if you want a trial, shoot me an email tonight at info. Email me if you want to sign up for the class at melissa at the stockswoosh.com. Does anyone want to talk about anything whatsoever? Hope everybody listened to everything I said so far tonight. How are we doing? Okay, here is my email. Again, I recognize some familiar faces here. If you want to try out of the room, email me. You're welcome to come. If you want to sign up for the class, email me. If you have questions, call me. I will take your calls. Don't call me tomorrow night, though. I'm on TV. <laughs> call me tonight or tomorrow before 2 o'clock. <laughs> All right. Have a good night, everyone. Good seeing everybody.
Thank you so much, Kathy. You're welcome. Have a great evening.